hey guys you welcome back to my channel so this is learn french with queen your trusted space for everything french if this is the first time you're stumbling on my video i say a big welcome and if you are wondering what's up on this platform do to check out my previous video if you like them give them thumbs up this share to love you and don't forget hit that subscription button hit the subscription button this video we'll be looking at how to read in French language in my previous video we examined how to read in French language making use of our basic rules that could help us navigate through reading and if you've not checked out my previous video the link is on the screen so you can catch up with what we'll be doing and for today's video we'll be looking at the sound sion when do we have the sound sion we'll be looking at the sound k. when do we have the sound k. So there are two possible times that we could have the sound k. Okay, so we could have them where we have our C, our C, which we call C, could give us the sound k. And we'll be looking at when do this C or our C in French language give us the sound k. And possible times when we could have our Q, U to give us the sound k. So let's dive in into today's reading. Ce n'est pas vrai. So note, this is an exception. So in my previous video, I said that whenever we have a CD underneath a C, it gives us the sound S. And when there is no CD underneath the C, it gives us the sound K. But this time around, we are having a C without a CD and it's giving us the sound S. We have S. I S plus E. So we have S. So when do we have C and it gives us the sound S? T gives us the sound S. When we have it in front of these three vowels, we have this vowel E, we have the vowel E, and we have the vowel Y. And note, the vowel Y as well gives the sound E. So we can see that in front of this C, we are having our E. That is why we have it to be SE and not QUE. So we have SE NEST PAS VRAI. C'est toujours Pareil. Don't let us forget our O sound. A chaque fois que. So we have our K sound here. So we have our Q U to give us the sound K as well. It is not only when we have a C without a C D that we have the sound K, but we could also have the sound K when we have our Q U. That is our Q U in French language. So we have our K plus E. So we have K. A chaque fois K. Je veux cuisiner. Don't let us forget our S in between two vowels. Cuisiner un bon petit plat. Il me manque. So don't let us forget our K sound. Our Q you giving us the K sound. Il me manque systématiquement. We could see our Q you giving us our K sound here as well. Des ingrédients. Don't let us forget our E accent aigu. Sebastian, our E as you. Ça t'embêterait. So we could see our C with a CD underneath it giving us the sound S. Okay? So we have ça t'embêterait de te rendre à l'épicerie. Don't let us forget our E as you. And our C, is our C having a E in front of it. Remember our rules that whenever we have E, E, and Y in front of a C, it gives us the sound S. So we have a p s r i du coin. So let's note. We say whenever we have a c without a c d underneath, it gives us the sound k. So how do I recognize the c without a c d that gives us the sound k and the sound s? When we have our c in front of a, o, and u, it gives us the sound k. So let's note that. So we could see for our coin, we have an O, the vowel O, in front of the C, our C. So that's why we have coin, K, O, and N. So we have coin, okay? L'épicerie du coin, acheter ce qu'il. Don't let us forget our K sound, please, il. So we have qu'il me manque. So our Que sound there as well, our monk. Pas de souci. So we could see our souci as well is having an 
e in front of it. So don't forget, whenever we are having our c in front of e, e and y, it gives the sound s. So that's why we have su c. Why does su c? Je peux y aller immédiatement. Immédiatement. So we have our e accent to you. Don't forget. Je n'ai rien de spécial de faire. Don't let us forget our e accent to you. Super! Alors, il me fait des poireaux et du parmesan. Don't let us forget our S in between two vowels. C'est noté. Our E accent aigu. Chef. Surtout, don't let us forget our O sound. Essaye de faire vite. Je meurs déjà de faim. D'un pas décidé. So, don't forget our E accent aigu. Décidé et satisfait. De pourvoir, de forget our O sound, rendre service à sa dure ciné. So let us forget our E accent aigu. Sébastien, our E accent aigu, se dirigeait vers la petite épicerie. Don't let us forget our E accent aigu. And we have our C with E in front of this. We give us the sound. That's why we have E, P, S, S, Re. A car -tier. So we have our K sound. Whenever you, have, you see your Q U in French language, it automatically gives us the sound K. Don't let us forget. So we have K, K plus A. We have car -tier. Qui se trouvait, don't let us forget our O sound and our K plus E. So we have our Q U, which gives us the sound K, K and E. So we have K. Se trouvait juste en bas de la rue. Il eut vite fait de faire le tout de tous les rayons. Don't let us forget our O sound. Quand la supérette, our E accent aigu, était petite. Pas de poireux à l'horizon. Uniquement, don't let us forget our K sound. K plus E, we have K unique, uniquement. Du parmesan. Our S in between two variables. Don't let us forget. Sébastien hésita. So we have our E accent aigu and our S in between two variables for hésita. Sébastien hésita quelques instants. So we have our quelques. Don't forget our K sound. Puis décida. Don't let us forget our E accent aigu. Se rendre au super. Marché. Don't let us forget our E accent aigu. Qui se trouvait? Don't let us forget our K sound. Whenever we say our Q, you give us the sound K. And our O sound for trouver. Quelques arrêts. Vous savez, our K sound dit de bus plus loin. Cela ne lui prendrait que quelques minutes. Sébastien se rendit donc à l'arrêt du bus. Et emprunta la ligne de pour se rendre au supermarché. Don't let us forget our O sound for pour and our E sound for supermarché. Heureusement, so we have our S in between two vowels here. Sa carte de bus se trouvait encore dans sa poche. Don't let us forget our O sound for trouver. À peine d'arriver. So here we are having a liaison. Normalement, we are meant to be having à peine arrivé. But rather it's pronounced à peine d'arriver. So there's a liaison there. So no start. À peine d'arriver, Sébastien reçu. So let's get our E accent to for Sébastien. And our CD underneath the C for reçu. So that's why we have plus U. We have reçu. Okay. Un appel de Laurence. Où diable es-tu passé? Don't let us forget our E accent figure. Tu en mets du temps pour acheter des poireaux et du parmesan. Don't let us forget our O sound for pour and our S in between two vowels for parmesan. Désolé. So we could see our E accent figure and our S in between two vowels. Je vais au plus vite. Il n'y avait pas ce que tu voulais à la supérette. Je suis donc allé à l'hypermarché. Don't forget our E accent aigu. Acheter ce qu'il, our K sound, ce qu'il te fallait. 
ok, à tout à l'heure. Essaie de te dépêcher quand même. So we could see our ear accent aigu, our circumflex, our circumflex gives a longer version of our accent graph, a little bit longer, but a bit relaxed. So we have it to be air as well. The pair air. Our air accent to give us the sound air. Our accent graph give us the sound air. And our circumflex as well give us the sound air as well. The pair she quand même. Don't let's forget our sound for quand même. Sébastien va crochet. Sébastien with the O accent aigu. Et se remit à la recherche des sacro-saint poireaux. Mais son regard se posa. Let us forget our S in between two vowels. Se posa fortuitement sur le rayon jeu vidéo. So we have our E accent aigu for our video. Et il s'offrit quelques, our Q sound, let us forget, quelques minutes à flâner. Tel un enfant le jour de Noël. So let us forget our O sound for jour. Revant à tout our O sound, ces jeux auxquels our K sound, il adorerait jouer s'il ne travaillait pas autant. Sébastien regarda l'heure. Il n'avait pas vu le temps passer. Il venait de perdre un quart d'heure. So let us forget our K sound for our quart d'heure. Et n'avait toujours our O sound pas fait ses courses. Sébastien décida our E sound de se concentrer sur sa mission. So here we have our sion. We could see that this mission is ending with S-I-O-N. So, we could have our sion whenever we are having this sound ending it. S-I-O-N, T-I-O-N, C-I-O-N. So, all these are the three possible sounds to give us our sion. So, we have mission. Mais, décidément, our E accent aigu, don't let us forget. Le supermarché était, we could see our E accent aigu. Un véritable labyrinthe. So we could see our E accent aigu. A chaque fois, de tu s'y trouvait un piège. So we could see our E accent aigu for de tu and our O sound. And for our trouvé as well, we could see our O sound as well. And for our piège, we have our E accent glove that gives us the sound A. Hey, don't forget. Sébastien ne put s'empêcher de s'arrêter au rayon TV. Ses yeux ébahis devant tant de nouvelles technologies. Donc, let us forget our O sound for nouvelle and our E sound, our E accent aigu for ébahi. Il en fut de même lorsqu'il, let us forget our Q, you that give us the sound. So, we have our lorsqu'il passa devant le rayon électrique. So no, this is another rule. Whenever we have our vowel and then our C afterwards, the rule we saw before was our C in front of the vowels. But this time around, whenever we have our vowel and our C coming after, it gives us the sound K. And that's why we have électromenage. Ou un commercial faisait. So we have our S in between two variables for faisait la démonstration. So we have our sion here. We could see our T I O N to give us the sound sion, and we have our E accent to give for demonstration. We have faisait la démonstration d'un aspirateur hyper puissant. Tu sautes perdu à admirer un aspirateur. So, don't let us forget our O sound. Alors, qu'il n'avait jamais, so we have our K sound there for qu'il n'avait jamais touché, don't let us forget our E accent aigu, ne saurait ce qu'un balai. Don't let us forget our K sound for our QU. Il ne résista pas non plus, don't let us forget our E accent aigu for résista, à la tentation. We have another sion here, we could see our I, T, I, O, N for our sion as well. De s'arrêter au stand japonais. Ou un maître, on ne peut pas au stand, un maître surchi, découpé, on va avoir un accent aigu, on va avoir au stand, découpé 
ébilement des tranches de saumon pour les proposer Don't ever forget our S in between two vowels à la dégustation because that our E accent is in our science sang here as well that Sebastian never jamais goûté our U sang and our E accent figure un poisson si délicieux so we, could, we said that our heads give us the sun in front of E, I and Y. Don't let us forget. So we are having our delicio. So that's why we have sio and not kio. Okay? Aussi parfaitement assaisonné. Don't let us forget our S in between two vowels and our E stands for assaisonné. Le ventre rempli après avoir, don't let us forget our S in between two vowels, dégusté. Our E has something you. Plusieurs, our S in between two vowels. Maki e sushi. Sebastian to me a panique. Don't forget our K sounds there. K plus E give us K. Panique. Lost kill our K sound here as well. Aperçu. Don't forget our C D underneath our C. Aperçu le rayon légume. Il se rappela alors sa mission à la science en y as well. Première, nous allons faire à la accent grave, give the sound A, à la accent aigu, give the sound A. Nous allons faire à la première, S en première, R, à la S en, les courses pour Laurence. Il regarda le, plus d'une heure c'était E. Couler. Don't let's forget our O sound and our E accent aigu. Écouler depuis son dernier appel. Il avait même eu droit à un message sur son téléphone. Our E accent aigu. Don't let's forget via téléphone portable. Des points de suspension. Vous savez, our sound sounds there as well. En guise, let us forget our S in between two vowels, de message. Le message qui tue, celui qui ne dit rien, mais veut tout dire. En moins de temps, qu'il n'en faut pour le dire. Ok, let us forget our O sound. Sébastien attrapa une branche de poireux en fonçant. Don't let us forget our See with a CD underneath it. So we have fun. Sa. Vers le rayon de la fromagerie. À la coupe achetée de parmesan. Il y a tout de même une hésitation. So here we have three rules here. We have our E accent here. Our S in between two vowels and our S. So hésitation. Lost. Que de la société d'avoir que sent la vendeuse à la S in between two vowels lui demanda s'il souhaitait son parmesan râpé ou en morceaux. Sébastien arriva enfin à la caisse. Malgré les nombreuses de la société d'avoir S in between two vowels en bûche, il avait de lutter pour avoir au centre, ne pas s'arrêter au rayon bon bon. Couper avoir au centre, sa respiration. Vous pouvez avoir sion, diazbe, pour avoir au centre, ne pas sentir la délicieuse. Donc, vous pouvez avoir au centre, avoir si d'agir vos sound. Vous pouvez si in front of our vowel E as well, and our S in between two vowels for U's. That's why we have delicious. Okay? Delicious odor de viennoiserie. So we have our S in between two vowels for noiserie. So we have viennoiserie. Il s'était tout de même arrêté pour avoir au sein aider une dame à G. A attraper une boîte de conserve. Même pressé, Sébastien restait 
servir bas. Et c'est seulement au moment de payer alors que son cœur battait la chamade. Et que nous avons pu faire notre sang, plus eux, il y a que son front était à la santé de en souhait. Que nous avons pu faire notre sang, Sébastien a perçu à la sédie qu'il a wa croissant avait oublié à wa eu à santé du dieu d'Azavia et oublié de prendre son pot feuille. So I hope you enjoyed today's reading. Don't forget to put this sounds into practice whenever you are reading. And if you have any questions as regarding this sound, do it to write me in the comment section. I'll be glad to reply. And if you want to know more about reading, do it to check out my previous video that I shown you on your screen. And Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Do share to loved ones who will love this content. And the big one, subscribe. It's that subscription button now. So see you in the next reading. A plus.